The debate over whether the F-18 Super Hornet is inferior to the iconic F-14 Tomcat has been around for years among aviation enthusiasts and military analysts. While nostalgia often favors the F-14, a closer look at the designs, performances, and operational roles reveals a more nuanced picture. The F-14 Tomcat, famous for its variable sweep wings and long-range interception capabilities, was a dominant force in naval aviation for decades. It could reach speeds over Mach 2.3 and was equipped with the powerful AN Aubugue 9 radar and long-range AIM-54 Phoenix missiles, designed primarily for air superiority and fleet defense during the Cold War era. Pilots praised its performance for speed and range, making it fearsome in air-to-air -air engagements. However, the F-14 had its share of challenges. It was complex to maintain, costly to operate, and prone to some reliability issues, including instances of dangerous flat spins. The pilot workload was also higher, due to its older avionics and less automated systems. In contrast, the F-18 Super Hornet reflects a shift toward multi-role versatility, reliability, and modern combat requirements. Though it is slower, with speeds topping around Mach 1.8, the F-18 excels in close-in dogfighting, carrier operations, and can perform air-to-air, air-to-ground, and electronic warfare missions with great effectiveness. The fixed wings and newer systems make it easier to land on carriers, improving safety and operational tempo. The F-18's avionics include helmet-mounted queuing and advanced missile systems like the AIM-9X Sidewinder, enhancing its agility in close combat or phone booth fights. Whereas the F-14 could outpace the F-18 in a straight line, the Super Hornet's agility, digital systems, and multi-role loadout make it a more flexible workhorse for today's naval air wings. Ultimately, the F-18 is not simply a lesser F-14, but rather a different tool tailored for evolving warfare demands. It prioritizes reliability, versatility, and cost-effectiveness, enabling the Navy to maintain combat readiness across a broad mission spectrum well into the future.